Hey everybody, welcome back. Jordan here. Today, actually, today and tomorrow, it's going to be over multiple days, uh, we're going to be doing some Lego shopping. We're going to be going bargain hunting at Walmart because there's a whole bunch of stuff that's coming out here in August of 2021. Like, the amount of new products coming out is absolutely insane. So I know retailers like Walmart, Mastermind Toys, Toys R Us, Target, things like that are going to be looking to make room on their shelves for all of the new releases. So a lot of the time these private retailers are not really private, but these big corporate retailers that sell Lego products will often put their products on sale when they know they have a bunch of new stuff that's going to be hitting the shelves relatively soon. So today and tomorrow, because it's 10 o'clock at night right now, so I'm and Walmart closes at 11, so I only think I'm going to have time to go to one Walmart today. <laughs> but then we'll go bright and early tomorrow as well to a couple different Walmarts. We're going to be doing some Lego shopping and looking for discounted deals. Woohoo! <laughs> oh, that, that was a big one. <laughs> but yeah, uh, I'm hoping to find some, some stuff maybe that we need or just some stuff that's going to be offered at great prices that uh, just sort of un unbeatable deals that would be good uh, to have moving forward into the future, right? Uh, so yeah, let's roll on out to uh, Walmart to do some Lego shopping. All right, everybody. So here we are at Walmart. Late night Lego shopping trip. Pretty sweet. Closes in about uh, 40 minutes. So let's roll on inside and see if there's anything good. Should we grab a cart? Is this a cart run? Maybe. Maybe we need multiple cards. I don't know. Should I buy this pallet of coffee? Potentially, maybe, possibly. All right, everybody, we're doing a classic Brixie voice over here. You know why? Because Walmart was having an absolute party. They were blasting some jamming tunes. I wasn't enjoying it the whole time, but we can't have that in our YouTube videos, right? That's not going to fly. So we got some three-in-one stuff, some classic stuff. We found those for a great price once upon a time. During the Black Friday days, there you go, a great Duplo set. Not that great but we've got some city stuff on sale here uh, this one here is on $29 so I think it's about $10 off or something like that but not overly interested although I do like vehicles city vehicles are great sets I, I love them because they can add vehicles to your Lego city right we've got some Harry Potter classic Hogwarts moments down on the bottom here little uh, textbooks and whatnot and then we got some more Harry Potter stuff over here and also we spotted the uh, Ford Bronco. That's not bad actually, because this has been somewhat difficult to find, but it is in the Jeep Wrangler spot. Got something on sale here, but unfortunately they're all sold out. Wish we were seeing more of these clearance tags here at this Walmart, but we actually go on a shopping trip uh, at Lethbridge as well in this video. We don't end up going in the morning, we go to Lethbridge and we find some great stuff on sale. Uh, Minions right here, this is actually a pretty good deal. I've already got a couple of these, I think, or no, no, I haven't. But this is $29. I don't even think this movie is even out yet. So I don't know why these sets are already being discounted. It really does seem strange to me. And actually, this is a really good deal right here. $49. The original price was $69.86. So it's a pretty high percentage of discount there. And I actually thoroughly enjoy this set. It's actually great. Like It's got like the minion lair inside the minions. It's really neat. We got some more Duplo stuff here. Not really our thing, as you can probably imagine. And on the end cap here, we've got some cool looking Jurassic World stuff. I gotta rewatch Jurassic World. I've seen it a few times, but it's a great film. Love it. Third one's coming out here relatively soon. We got some friend stuff here, and there is an empty spot in which the party boat used to be for $89 on from $109.86. However, I found those at Walmart in Calgary for $69, I believe it was. So $89 wasn't the best deal. Got some Mario stuff here. One for $10 off, that's $29. Mario hasn't really been my thing, but I really do want to do something underneath the table with it. I think it'd be pretty neat. Got some more Mario stuff here. You'll notice that it's spread out throughout the entire Walmart Lego department. And then some Lego Star Wars stuff here. Kylo Ren's Command Shuttle is sick, as you all know recommend that set in the biggest way as you can see we're not having the greatest time finding lego deals here most of them are already sold out and i'm surprised actually more of these aren't already discounted as like we said there's a bunch of new stuff coming out here ninjago not really into it 
Plus, we got some Mario stuff over here. I've seen people in the States getting huge deals on video stuff, and I sort of want to capitalize on that, but I have not seen it at any of our Walmarts, unfortunately. Once again, more Mario stuff on sale. The question is, is when are they going to start blowing out this stuff here to make room for all the August releases? Now, the weird thing about Walmart is I've been noticing that sometimes they split their Lego departments in the other toy aisles, and sometimes there's discounts in other toy aisles. You just have to find the clearance aisle. But over here, there's actually more Lego that's sort of not with the other Lego. Isn't it sort of weird how they would split it? In fact, some of the best sets are here, like the bonsai tree and also the flower bouquet and also some architecture stuff grogu the stormtrooper helmet and also the death star final duel like why would that not be with the lego department these are some of the greatest lego sets that they have at this walmart right now and why are they not with the other stuff that's just beyond me it's just sort of really really strange some city stuff and some more of the new speed champion stuff here including another Ford Bronco, the Supra, also the Corvettes and the McLaren. But in general, I mean, there wasn't a whole lot of stuff on sale at this particular Walmart. They have some of the new stuff, but not all of the new stuff. I'm actually pretty highly disappointed with the overall turnout of the Lego selection at this particular Walmart. Sort of strange. I mean, of course, there's some trolls and stuff on sale, but who wants trolls, right? Not, not a huge theme. Although I did thoroughly enjoy the movie. Honestly, the best deal of the day that we found at this Walmart here was definitely this minion set right here from the Rise of Gru, which once again, isn't even out yet. So not sure why that stuff's already being discounted. Maybe it's just not popular. Maybe they're trying to clear it out. Uh, I don't know. Maybe the theme's just really not working for them. And here I am with some really loud background music saying, yeah, sure, that sucks. There's nothing here. We'll try our luck later, maybe at a Toys R Us and some walmarts uh, on a new day on a new day late night shopping trip probably not worth it and i also found some bankers boxes uh three pack for like nine dollars which work fantastic for storing away instruction manuals so that was a huge find at the walmart definitely worth the trip because we found the bankers boxes we needed sweet all right so no luck the other night and i decided you know what, i'm probably not going to do any more shopping I'm done with it. <laughs> but we're actually uh, in Lethbridge right now, so I figured, why not check out the Walmart in Lethbridge? Because I'm actually here for a wedding. So why not check a Walmart that's not in town here, sort of a, a smaller town that might have some deals. So let's head on inside here and see if they got any good Lego deals at this Walmart in Lethbridge, Alberta. So here's the Lego aisle in the Lethbridge Walmart. Definitely a little bit different. Standard toy aisles are like that, and then stretching along the back wall, we have all of our Lego. So let's see what we got going on here. Hmm, police monster truck heist. Look at that truck. It's pretty cool. And that's beside this uh, set that seems to be on sale. So it's $59, regular $80. It doesn't seem too bad for a nice airplane set. 286 pieces in that one there. Looks like this uh, diving yacht is on for $19. We saw these race cars, actually don't have these cars. 190 pieces on for $29, Canadian of course, right? Do, 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 do. Hey, that's actually a really good deal right here. Uh, not a huge like price per piece deal, but it comes with like a light brick, right? I'm pretty sure, yeah, light brick and also a sound brick, which is pretty different. Also it comes with all the panels, including these like jailed pieces, also these dogs, which are super cute. Check out that bulldog there. Regular $140 on sale for $89. So that's actually a pretty good dealio as well. I might actually have to think about that. Cause that's pretty cool. We got our base plates down here. Just the standard blue, green, and white. And then the large gray ones don't seem to be on any sort of discount at all. This was 50 bucks. It's on sale for $29. More of like a play feature though with the flying helicopters, right? Not really anything up our alley. Down here we've got that same Duplo set that we saw at the Walmart in Edmonton. And what else? We got some Harry Potter stuff here. So like the clock tower, astronomy tower, the three in one section with the toy store. Some other Harry Potter stuff. Oh, here's a party boat down here. Wonder how much that is. 
Uh, friendship bus, so it's in the wrong area. Okay. Oh, there's a good deal. This is regular $100. It's on sale for $69. That's the frozen Arendelle Castle beside the Rapunzel Tower. And along here, another uh, frozen set on sale. Mario stuff, all at standard prices. Oh, oh, this is another four plus set, too bad. Regular $80 on sale for uh, $59, but look, you get a big fig of Hulk, you get Loki, you get Thor, Iron Man, Cop uh, Captain Marvel. Ninjago set on sale for $39. Seem to be clearing out lots of Ninjago stuff. It's obviously making room for, for some of that new product coming out here in August. And there's just like a small selection of Star Wars stuff here. Nothing crazy. Hmm. Oh, I think I missed some clearance tags over here. Right beside the uh, Arendelle Castle, we have some Dots products on for $14. But you know, we got the lots of Dots coming out. So when we have to do those fences around our train area, definitely going to be getting the lots of Dots. I should probably get a couple of those so that we can start to do some graffiti. Oh, here's the party boat. All right, we saw it down where? We saw it down here. And that's beside the Minion stuff that's not on sale at this Walmart. It's weird how it varies from Walmart to Walmart, hey? But these are on sale for $49. And it says it was at $69, but that is a lie. Let me check how much they are uh, regular retail price here in Canada. Yeah, on the Lego website, they're usually $109.99. So they're $60 off, so it's about 60% off. That is incredible. Oh my gosh, we could build a party yacht. That's a crazy deal. 60% off, oh my gosh, how do, you, how do you let that go? I don't know if I'm gonna be able to let that go. <laughs> so I guess here we are having a party in Lethbridge. Definitely gonna pick up a couple more party boats at 60% off, that is insane. What? That's crazy. Oh, this is the clearance aisle that we're walking into here, I think. Is there anything else? I don't see any more Lego in this aisle there. Well, oh my gosh, that is such a good deal. That's crazy. 60% off the party boats. I know I found them uh, in a Walmart at uh, where we were in Calgary, and they were $69, and this is even better. $49? That's incredible. So we're definitely going to pick up a couple party boats for sure. I don't know why, I just got a good feeling about this Walmart too, because it's blue. It's just a good color. All right, here we go. A little bit of a different Lego aisle than the last Walmart. Got some city stuff, some classics, some three-in-one. Oh, perfect, some bent base plates. Definitely prefer it when my base plates come bent out of the package. That's good. But see what I mean, though? There's no consistency with the Walmart sales because some of the stuff that I saw at sale at the other Walmarts, I don't see on sale here, which is just sort of strange to me. Why would it not be consistent? I guess there's some troll stuff on sale, but I don't think anybody is buying anything having to do with trolls for some reason. <laughs> well, not for some reason. We all know why. It just didn't do well. I, I actually do like the movies, though. Over here, we got some video stuff, also some uh, Mario, Avengers thing up top here, in which I've seen on sale at Walmarts before. That actually, I think, it is on sale. Thirty-nine eighty-six, four hundred and seventy-seven pieces. I think that's on sale. It's just not marked with the Starburst or like the the pop-out tag. Once again, another inconsistency. So we've got some uh, Minecraft stuff down here. Also the uh, Dodge the Champion set. Some superhero stuff. Some Star Wars stuff. Some Ninjago. Nothing really coming out and smacking us in the face here, is it? Over here in this aisle, no Lego on sale, I don't think. Oh, we got some more Lego over here. So we got like, once again, probably some of the best Lego stuff, not in the Lego aisle. <laughs> it just seems really weird to me. It's just strange, but yeah, nothing here on this Walmart. The only thing we have found is inconsistencies, that's for sure. So I guess you sort of snooze, you lose in this particular instance at this Walmart. So no luck at the uh, last Walmart there, but we were doing some wandering around downtown Lethbridge 
and I spotted a Toys R Us, so of course we're heading in. Oh yeah, see look, I knew we got a good deal on those party boats for $49. Here they are for $109. This is the Friends area, but check out this huge Lego department that they have. It's massive. Very neatly organized as well. Lots of Harry Potter stuff here. Lots of like duplicate sets. Face though, just to sort of fill the shelves, right? Then we've got three-in-one stuff. Some Marvel stuff here. Next to Star Wars. Good stuff. Remember when these were all the craze? Yeah, <laughs> that was sort of a false call. Readily available now. Minion stuff, Minecraft, Technic. City stuff over here. Ninjago. It's funny because like, once again, inconsistencies between shopping stores because I've, I've seen so many people online getting just killer deals at Toys R Us on certain products and I actually found some killer deals on their website as well. But I'm more of like an in-store guy. And of course, I don't really see any deals here at all. So I guess it's sort of a, a strikeout here at uh, Toys R Us as well. Usually we have good luck at like these, like in the smaller towns and these sort of stores, but I guess we got the party boats at Walmart for $49 and that's really about it for our Lethbridge shopping adventure here. Yeah, so now we're back at home. Had a great time at the wedding. It was fantastic. And, you know, whenever we're out and about, we've got to do some shopping. And we sort of started in Edmonton here and made our way to Lethbridge, made our way to a couple different Walmarts, Toys R Us. I see, like, on Instagram, I see a whole whack of people, like, scoring on, on products at Walmart for, like, fantastic prices. And those are some of the ones that we saw in the video. Mind you, those are people from the United States. So I guess, like... Uh, Walmarts in the United States are definitely clearing out some of those products and, and here in Canada it's just not the same they're not doing it yet but I have a feeling that they're gonna do it and I, usually it's July usually it's the month that they start to clear the stuff out to make room for all the new stuff coming out in August and I guess it's just not happening yet maybe they'll be like oh crap when the August shipments arrive they'll be like we got to get rid of some of this stuff to make room for all this new product but either way we got some party boats it's really the thrill of the hunt for me I like going out there and just trying to find stuff on on great deals, like 60% off the party boats is like unheard of. That is incredible. So that really worked out, that was nice. And I guess sometimes you strike out, sometimes you win, sometimes you lose when it comes to finding deals on Lego. We've had luck at Mastermind Toys, I've had luck at Walmart before. I go there quite frequently, so I'm sure we'll find something in the future as well because I enjoy hunting for the stuff, especially when you're just out and about in uh, random towns or grocery shopping or whatever it is. Guys, that's really about it for today. Remember to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for some more great stuff. Thanks for popping by and have a great one.